Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. I'm Addison, if you're new here. I post college related videos specifically around nursing school. I'm in my senior year of nursing school. I graduate May of 2021. I have exciting news. I got engaged. This is what the ring looks like. I got proposed to on December 31st of 2020, which was yesterday, depending on when you're watching this, it's January 1st today. Um, he didn't want to do it when the ball dropped, so he did it in his aunt's driveway. Um, I was hurrying him out of the car, like, let's just go in there, you're being a butt, like, let's just go. So then, he's being slow, I'm like, let's oh like let's go inside right now and so I turn around start walking and I turn back around to kind of like get him to start like coming and he was down on one knee and I was like all excited jumping up and down jumping up for joy um we've been me and his name is Clayton he watches my video so hi Clay um his name's Clayton and we have been together since December 4th of 2015. Um, yeah, so that is about five years. Um, five years together. It was our sixth New Year, sixth Christmas this year. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited. Um, to start this new chapter in my life. Um, I will be graduating in May of 2021 and then we decided we wanted to get married in May of 2022. We have a date that we want but it just depends on like what other people like what the venue that we're gonna try to get what dates work for them if the 21st is already booked. Um, also, my friend um, graduates in May of 2022, so that's going to be difficult um, because I am asking her to be one of my bridesmaids, um, so it's just a little, little scary um, thinking that she might not be in my wedding, um, but that's okay. We're not going to think about it. We're going to hope and pray that she can come to the wedding. Her wedding is also two weeks after mine. So hers is June 4th. So if you do two weeks above that, that's the day. And hers is on a Saturday. So we're doing a Saturday wedding. Um, ours is about two weeks apart. That's a little scary and sketchy, but I don't know. <laughs> I don't have no idea how any of this is going to work yet. Um, I have a lot planned already, which um, I'm planning on doing some wedding planning videos here on this channel now. Um, this is more going to be lifestyle, vlog, more vlogs um, of us going to see the venue and going to do different things. Um, I'm super, super, super excited. So today, since it's the first, I already had um, all my bridesmaid boxes pre made all I had to do was get shirts and get their sizes um so that's what I did my sister is one of the bridesmaids so I gave her her box already so these are the shirts that I made I got men's size or I got men's shirts um they are long sleeved and um my mom kind of we DIY'd them, so they were four dollars and ninety four cents a piece, which come out to like thirty bucks because I wanted a shirt made for myself as well. So, so they're men's and they're long sleeved. So I was thinking like it's one, it's still winter, so that's a great. Um, people can wear them now. Um, when I go to look for dresses and stuff like that, more like March or October or any of these like nothing really during the summer where I'm gonna try to do no planning well I'm gonna plan of course because I'm off of school but um we'll see how that goes I just thought it'd be nice because we're having a spring wedding and anything before that happens in 
the winter, whether it's my bridal shower, whether it, whatever is going on, we're dress shopping, bachelorette is more going to be February, March, more cool air. Um, I really wanted soft shirts as well. It was hard to find women's soft shirts um, that were short sleeved and or long sleeved in the colors that I wanted. Our um, wedding colors are also, we're going to have a lot of greenery. Um, our main color is a light slash dusty blue. Um, it's going to be a mix between dusty and light because it's hard to find everything light. It's hard to find everything dusty, so I'm going to kind of mix them together in a way. And um, also white, greenery, blue is the main color, a light blue, and um, gold, gold accents. So that's our theme. So that's what these colors are. I want to show you guys my shirt. So this is what it looks like. My mom made them. We literally got, um, I just thought it was awesome. My mom was able to do this tonight and such great quality. She did this on the Cricut. So that was awesome. This just says bride. If you can't read it, I know my dad was like, oh my God, I can't read it. Like that. You're being a dad. So I got a large in all of them except for my little sister. She got an extra small in men's because I have no idea. So I just got everyone larges because we're all, literally all of us are heavier chested. So that um, will help too with that. So that's my shirt. I can't believe I'm a bride. Like that is literally insane. Like I never thought in my life at 22, I would be considered a bride or a fiance or anything like that. I'm so excited. So I want to show you one of the boxes. My mom put the shirts in there and we kind of fixed them the way that I wanted them. So I'm not going to try to disturb too much of them. Um, it was really hard to pick a maid of honor that I will say, um, I'm not close with like, I'm close with all of my friends, but I'm not. Two of my friends are planning weddings. One of them's already married and has a baby on the way. And the other one is single. Well, she's dating um, and stuff like that. So, like, who do you pick? I don't know. I've had the hardest time. That was, like, the one thing I've had the hardest time with is picking that because everyone wants to be that role and I can't have everybody. So it's either going to be my sister or somebody else and everyone's just going to have to like it because that's what's going to happen. Um, so I'm just going to show you one of these boxes. So this is for my one friend. I have sticky notes that say what friend gets what. Um, and then they each have a quote. They're just different size boxes. There's a, the littlest box up into the biggest box. The biggest box is for the maid of honor. And then um, it kind of goes down from there. Um, and also size of box is pretty much going to be my lineup. I think is how my lineup is going to go. Not 100%. But this is what it looks like. We're missing one, compete, one key component. Um, on the top here, I'm going to put a handwritten letter from me about our life and asking them to be my bridesmaid. So yeah, I bought everyone a Bath & Body Works candle because me and Clayton love candles. That's the one thing like we absolutely love. So everyone got a different candle that I thought they would like. Um, and then each of them got something different. This from the body shop. This is like a mango bar soap. Um, so all of that is different. And then they each got, I made these. Um, these were $2.49 at Joan Fabrics. So they just, I put their name. They're like little canvases. They have little easels that go with them, but those were an extra $2. I'm like, we don't need those. So I just got this and I painted, I used like one of these fake plants and I put it here and I drew a whole circle and then I kind of like did it like 
wrote it all in pencil and then painted with acrylic paint over top and I made these cute little flowers uh, this is like the most exciting thing um, and then I got a bath bomb not everyone has the same things either some people have a bath bomb some have a bath like soak some of them have bath salts but everyone has a candle they have something with mango um, and they all have a shirt and they all have one of these personalized. So there's a couple things that are different than most. I'm just gonna take everything out. This wasn't like spectacular. So I'm just not gonna move this shirt. So this is what the shirt is. It's the same as the white, just in a dusty blue. And then it says bridesmaid. I mean, my mom, me and my mom made these. Like, I'm like, oh my God. $12.99 for both. I paid $30 for all of the shirts, mine included. Wow. And I um, collectively spent $70 on all these candles, but um, all of these candles were half off, so I got more candles for my buck for $70. This is not bad because they're originally $24 a piece. So, and I've collected this stuff over the over the time and then these were two dollars so I, I would say roughly like 50 bucks a person maybe less than that Seven, I don't know <laughs> I don't know the math but this is what everyone has except the maid of honor has the um, maid of honor on it so yeah this is what their shirts look like so um, I'm probably it's 11 12 so I'm probably going to leave to writing letters tomorrow night um, due to the fact that, um, and we're kind of covering up the bridesmaid part um, of these so they can open the letter and um, I'm not seeing any friends until Tuesday, I think is my first friend that I see. One friend is out of town. This um, I'm seeing this friend on Tuesday. Um, the other friend, I gotta find out when she works, and I gotta find out for the other one as well. Um, the one that's out of town won't get her box until she comes back into town. Um, so yeah, that is my update for everybody. Here's another close-up of my ring. It's from Kade Jewelers. It is a Neil Lane. It is like, like I am in shock. Um, it's three fourths of a carat all together. I think the center diamond is a third of a carat. Um, it's just absolutely stunning. Like I, <sighs> but this video is much longer than I anticipated. I only anticipated 10 minutes, but I did talk a lot. So if you have any other questions, Please comment, like, and subscribe. Also hit the bell notification so you get notified every time I post because my posts get lost, especially with this wedding planning. You don't want to miss out. So we're just going to comment. Um, I also, if you want to comment a question, I will do a QA and a um, with everything wedding planning that I have done so far or any questions that you guys have, please let me know in the comments down below and I will surely answer them. So I hope you guys have had a Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, New Year's, every holiday. I hope you had a good one and I will talk to you later.